praticamente livre, o vento sopra moderado no quadrante norte e neste momento estava a esperar uma temperatura moderada. Just finished having dinner at Sata Sera. We had a paella, croquetas, papas bravas, sangria. It was a great meal. This is the town at night. My camera's gonna die, and I just wanted to get this, but this is our block. I'm so in love with this little town. The Mirador de Ses Barques, the view of the boats. So I suggest to stop there and have a look. Good morning. It is day two in Campaniat. This is like our actual first full day. We went to bed after dinner pretty early. We were both just so tired from the 12 hour travel day. We came downstairs and had breakfast at the finca that we're staying at, which is similar to an Airbnb, but here in Campania, they call them a finca. And so she prepared um, like a fresh fruit salad, a homemade chocolate croissant, which was delicious. And now we're just getting ready to go walk around in town, get some coffee. There's some birds flying around. And then we're gonna go to uh, Dea and Solier. I'm just gonna start traveling around different parts of Mallorca while we're here for the next uh, five, six days. So there's so much to explore, but I do enjoy waking up in this space where it's just so light and fresh and airy being on the, the countryside of Mallorca. It's just so beautiful being surrounded by the mountains. I'm gonna go explore the finca a little bit more, go down by the pool, check out the view of the mountains and just get started for the day.
center of Solier. The tram is about eight euros, and you get some really, really beautiful views. We didn't anticipate the weather being so nice today, or else we would have brought our bathing suits and would have went by the water to relax a little bit. So instead, we just got some drinks and sat by in the marina park and um, you know just took it all in. Next we're going to Daya. Um, it's about five o'clock so we got a little bit of a late start today because we were just so tired and jet lagged from all the traveling yesterday. <laughs> Prior to coming to the beach, um, Mo and I stopped at the little supermarket in Campanet and we picked up a baguette, we picked up some fresh ham and salami and um, you know, drinks and stuff, chips. And Mo was just saying that this is the best way to spend the day because you go to the supermarket and like a baguette is like, how much was the baguette, Mo? Like, not even two, less than two euros. It was less than two euros. <clears throat> the ham was like less than two dollars. No, the ham was only was like five, but it's a beautiful ham and it's amazing, it's delicious. So, yeah, we just were here. The only thing is, we might be getting a ticket. <laughs> um, okay. Fingers crossed, we don't. But parking is very, very limited. And I did see when I was doing some research that if you don't get oh no this girl fell if you don't get parking nearby then the parking lot is about a 30 minute walk um so, and we have kind of a larger suv which doesn't help so there right as we were turning there was one um parking spot and we were able to just snag it but the car in front and back had a ticket so fingers crossed they came around already and we don't have a ticket, but if so, I don't know. Spain so far has been 10 out of 10 for me. What about you, Mo? Yeah. 10 out of 10, yep. We had to take a break here because these are the steps <laughs> to go down and we still have quite a way up to go. Here we go again. <laughs> are you serious? Uh, Babe. Give me, give me something, hurry up. Hurry. 